One of the biggest reasons why Antarctica is so sparsely populated is, unsurprisingly, the fact that it's so cold. Of course, it's no secret that Antarctica is so cold, however, I think a lot of us tend to conveniently underestimate just how freezing this place can be. Whether for digging, running, skiing, or hiking, the adventurers have to abide by a strict dress code if they hope to survive. Even at that, it is important to also make adjustments to your dress code time and again if you hope to survive the unforgiving weather. According to the official tourism website for Antarctica, you can see a stern warning against sweating, especially in the winter. This is because sweat essentially packs your clothes full of moisture. This in turn will freeze the outer layers of your outfit and pretty much melt, causing potentially harmful consequences for when you start to warm up again. For someone like Colin who had to do a lot of lifting and moving, this can be especially challenging. I mean, how do you even survive in an environment where you can barely sweat without endangering your life?